Uh, I thought I'd do a little demonstration um, of my digital painting setup. A few people have commented that they weren't super sure what exactly I was doing uh, in the speed painting video. It was a little unclear what actually is the cursor and what exactly is my hand doing uh, off the screen. So um, this is my desk. Uh, and you can see this drawing board is connected to my regular computer. Uh, and you can see I have a I have a couple of different screens here. You can see that I have uh, kind of a large desk set up. Uh, and the Cintiq it can be angled like a, kind of like a regular drawing board. Um, it's just digital. And I use a pen. This is the pen. Uh, so I don't know how well you can see that, but it has this interchangeable tip, which you draw directly on the screen with. And you just hold it and draw, just like a just like any regular pen. So this is how it looks when I'm drawing. Um, I can try and show it up a close view. I like to wear a glove when I draw because I find I don't like the feeling of my hand rubbing on the screen. Um, after I'm working for a while it can get a little bit warm uh, and I just uh, don't like the feeling of it. So I wear a glove with the fingers cut off. Um, it just helps my hand sort of slide more comfortably across the screen and I can get into my work without being focused on like sweaty palms or something like that. Uh, especially in the summertime when it's warm, it can be a little uncomfortable to hover over this hot screen for many hours at a time. Um, but yeah, so this, the, the Cintiq has several buttons on each side and I use those, for example, to save or undo. Um, you can also do a lot more with it, like zooming, but I, I don't really do that. I just uh, I just use them for saving and, and undo, pretty much. Um, undo is probably the best function uh, that, you, that you can use digital drawing for compared to regular drawing. I think it's a lifesaver sometimes. Um, but yeah, so this is basically what it looks like when I draw. I just use a round brush for the most part with a blending function so that I can make smooth edges. Uh, and I can kind of sample from one section of the drawing to get the color that I want and then adjust the size of the brush and then I can just draw just like I would with any other drawing materials. And that's basically it. It's pretty straightforward. I know it's a little bit strange if you're not used to this sort of thing to uh, when you just see what's happening on the screen to really understand uh, what is digital drawing? I used to think that people were drawing with a mouse and I was completely blown away by what was what was coming up Like how are people possibly doing this with a mouse? I'm not that coordinated with one But uh, no, it's a pen <laughs> And it's quite easy to use